job right now. On the exhale, turn your palms away and push the air down, down, and down. And on the inhale, bring up. On the exhale, push the air down, down, and down. On the inhale, look up. On the exhale, push the air down and lift your chin, come to your chest. Keep your hands back behind you, so with your fingers, waving your arms as best you can. And then sweep the arms forward at your fingertips, maybe touch the floor. And then sweep them back this time. Lift your chest, interlace your fingers, and lift your chest. And on the exhale, sweep forward and fold forward, bowing. And then leave your left hand where it is. Take your right arm to the ceiling. Look up. And on the exhale, bring your hands down. Inhale, opposite arm goes up. And exhale, come in. Inhale, sweep the arms to the ceiling. And exhale, bring your hands to your heart for a moment. And then release your arms, stretch your legs out, give a little shake, shake, shake. And then come around onto your chin. Sure, do you mind if I close the door all the way? Oh, gosh. The garbage can is keeping it from closing. <laughs> Thank you. Appreciate that. All righty. Sitting up on your chin. And Take a big breath in, lift your arms up. And exhale, push the air away. Take your hands behind your back, interlace your fingers, look down on the floor, stretch out. Inhale, sweep the arms to the ceiling, glance up. Exhale, just let your hands come down by your side, and then shrug your shoulders up towards your ears. Take a big breath in. And the exhale, press them down. The inhale again, lift up. Exhale, press it down. Inhale, lift. Exhale, press down and look over your left shoulder. Inhale, look center, lift the shoulder. Exhale, press down, look over your right shoulder. Inhale, center, lift up. Exhale, lower the shoulders down. Inhale, all the way up. And exhale, push your hands down. Take your left leg out to the side, knee is bent. Take the palm inside the inner thigh, take the opposite arm up and lean downward. And breathe. That's it. Keep your foot, yes. Yeah. Use your block if you need. Inhale. And exhale. Now close the palms at your heart and breathe. Keep leaning back. Nice. Open up your arms all the way, and then bring your hands behind your ears, gently touching in so you can get your elbow down. Breathe in and out. Now, your top elbow now is going to close to the bottom elbow. And then inhale, lift all the way up. Find the down. And take your elbow down. And then open all the way up. One more time, closing down. And lift all the way up, open up your arms, and come all the way up, lift your heart to the ceiling, exhale, bring your hands down, and then bring your knees toward the other knee, cats and cows, rolling the spine up and down, just feel that nice movement, rolling, and then when you find your center, pause there, come back up onto your shin, circle your arms to rise, look up, Inhale, bring your hands all the way down by your side. Step out with your right foot to the side, palm facing in. Other arm goes up and lean down. Uh, leaning back with your upper body. Breathe in and breathe out. Take the top arm, close it to the bottom arm, look down, and then inhale, sweep the arm all the way up. And again, closing down. And take the arm up. Bring your palms to your heart. And breathe. Thumbs towards your breastbone there. Breathe in. And breathe out. That's it. And then open up your arms once again. Take your hands gently like behind your ears. And breathe. And take the top elbow. Close it down to the bottom elbow. And inhale. 
rotate up. Again, exhale, closing down. Inhale, taking it up. One more time, take it down. And open all the way up. Separate your arms and come all the way up, arms to the ceiling. Exhale, hands come down. Bring your knee toward the other knee. Cats and cows, once again, continually loosening up. Breathing in and breathing out. Then downward facing dog. When you're ready, just pick up your tush. Press your heels down. Open the fingertips. Breathe in. And breathe out. Feel where the breath is going. Notice where your breath is going. Inhale. Exhale. Come forward a little bit. Drop onto your knees. And rise up onto your shins. Circle the arms. So rise up. Glance up if that's right to your neck. Exhale. Push the air away. And come down by your side. Taking your left leg out to the side. Long leg. I'm rotate the toes up. So when we move around, your toes fold in perfectly fine. But Start out with them up. Taking your right arm up and lean over toward the orange wall. Here are the space of your house. Breathe in and breathe out. Inhale, exhale. Now bring your hands gently behind your ears. Feel the engagement of your belly here. And then rotate your spine so you're looking at the floor. So you're kind of sitting back a little bit, keeping your toe up as long as you can with that long leg. Looking at the floor, maybe drop down a little bit more. Maybe your head goes toward the floor even more. Elbows are nice and wide. Inhale. Exhale. Then place your hands down underneath your shoulders. Take your right arm and reach it up to the ceiling. Stretching up. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. And then we'll switch. Take the top arm down. Take the other arm all the way up. And up. Breathe and breathe. Now take the top arm. Maybe a little thread the needle. So scoop it underneath your right shoulder underarm. And reach over toward the opposite wall. Just scooping it under. And then reach it back up to the ceiling. Inhale. Reach up. And exhale. Scoop it underneath and over toward the wall to your right. Breathe in and breathe out. And then bring that arm all the way back up to the ceiling. And then bring the hand all the way down and walk your hands around toward your long leg as far as it'll go. Maybe one hand goes on the opposite side. Maybe not. Doesn't matter. Just hold over. It's, you know, limiting in your range here. And then from there, wherever your right hand is, leave it there. Take your left arm to the ceiling. And glance up right here. Inhaling. Exhale. Inhale. Now exhale. Bring the top pinky to your bottom pinky. So you have cross like a tiger arm. Hold it there. Bend your elbows. Lower your nose down toward wherever it goes. Just lower your head. And then lengthen out your arms and walk yourself around to the front. Bring your knee all the way in. Catch the cows. Rolling through. Breathe in and breathe out. Feel that nice motion. And then when you are ready, downward facing dog. Hips lift. Again, pressing through. Lengthening your chest. Root to your legs. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, come forward, drop onto your knees, and rise up onto your shins. Inhaling, circle in the arms, lifting up. Exhale, push the air away and bring your hands all the way down. Take your right leg out to the side. Again, toes are up, heel is down for as long as you can manage it. Hips toward the front. Inhale, circle the arms. And dropping your right arm on your leg, lean over. Find that leg. Inhale. Exhale. Try to keep your upper arm over your ear as much as you can so you're leaning back. Breathe in. And breathe out. Now keep leaning over and take your hands gently behind your ear. There. And then swivel from your waistline to look at the floor. Balance there. And then see if you can take your head down much as you can, 
breathing and breathing. Emptying the breath every time. Inhale. Exhale. And then let your hands come down. Straighten out your arms. Take your left arm to the ceiling, glancing up. And breathe. Try to straighten your right arm as best you can. That's it. Pushing the floor away. Inhale. And exhale. And then we'll switch. Take the top arm down. Take the bottom arm up. Lifting it up. Leaning back as much as you can. Take that nice long breath in. And then take the top arm. Scoop it underneath and across. Reaching over. Dropping down a little bit. Maybe bend that left arm a little bit. Scoop it underneath. Breathe in. And breathe out. And then take that arm back up to the ceiling. Lifting it up. Inhale. On the exhale, bring the hand down. And then walk both hands around towards your long leg. And fold over the best you can over this long leg. Let your head drop. Breathe in. And breathe out. Kind of feel like you're moving your left hip out a little bit. And then take your right arm to the ceiling and glance up to your top thumb the best you can. Stretch out your neck. Inhale. And exhale. On the exhale, bring the hand down pinky to pinky like you're a tiger doing a tiger walk. And bend your elbows and drop your head down. Breathe in and out. You feel a nice long stretch behind that right leg. Feel that. Enjoy it. Take another breath just as you are. And then straighten out your arms and walk your hands back to the center. Bring your feet in and downward facing dog. Lift your hips, press through, pedal it out, letting the backs of the legs feel this nice movement. And then find your pose, let your head hang down as if it's going to touch the floor. Tuck your chin into your chest a little bit more, feel the shoulders broad. And then go ahead and lift your heels, bend your knees, and walk up toward the front of your space, holding over right here. Let go everything. Feel that nice release through the spine, the shoulders, the head, the neck. Alternate then one knee or then the other, back and forth, let your knees a little walk. But most importantly here, feel your hips shift. Wherever they shift, feel that. And maybe it turns into like a little upper body twist here. Just moving around, moving around. And then find your center. Then roll up the spine all the way. Pick the belly button up. Circle your arms to reach up to the ceiling. When you come up, lift the plant up. And exhale with your hands to the center of your heart. And on the exhale, release your hands down by your side. Roll your shoulders around. Make yourself comfortable. All right. Take your right foot and just step forward a little bit. A little bit. That's it. And turn your, make sure your feet, you know what, let's do a railroad track feet. Look down, make sure your straight leg. Take your arms to the ceiling, stretch up. And then on the exhale, fold over the long leg. You may need your blocks. You may need to bend your front knee a little bit or a lot of it. Just see where you go with this. See where your hands go. And breathe. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Now inhale. Come all the way up and let your left, your right arm go up to the ceiling and your opposite arm go back. Reaching back. That's it. And then fold over again. Both hands are going to melt over that front leg. Go down you go. Find your balance. Now stay here and take your back leg, your right leg, and step back to warrior one footing. So find your footing and then rise up to your warrior one. All the way. Back and breathe. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. On the exhale, take your hands all the way down and walk yourself back enough that you are taking your plank pose. And breathing, pressing into the hands, 
On the exhale, drop your knees, point your toes, and lower yourself down to the floor all the way. Take your elbows, imagine they're being tied together behind you, and then roll your shoulders away from your ears, press to the top of your feet, press to your pelvis, and lift your upper body up a little bit. We have a little baby cobra going on. Squeeze into your lower back. Well, lift your hands off the mat. It's perfectly fine with me. Breathe in. On the exhale, lower all the way down. Keep your upper body down. Lift your legs off the floor from the hip joint. Lifting and breathing. Inhale. On the exhale, lower your feet down. Push back to a child's pose. Let the back stretch out. And then downward facing dog when you're in. Picking your hips up and pedaling it out again. Feel the shift in the hips back and forth, back and forth. And then press both heels down, find that length. Inhale, lift the heels, bend the knees, look forward and make your way up to the front of your space, folding over right here. Inhale, circle the arms, rise up, looking up. Exhale, bring the hands to the center of your heart. Pause your break. Breathe in and breathe out. All right, so either backwards from you guys, it'll be your left foot. My left foot too, backwards. Take one little gentle step forward. All right, railroad track those feet. Check it out. Inhale, sweep the arms to the ceiling. And exhale, fold over your legs, dropping into it again. Use your blocks if you need to. Inhale, exhale. Head is heavy, top of the head toward the floor. Breathe in and breathe out. Feel a little release in your belly also here. Lose your hips, draw the left hip back a little bit, maybe. Breathe in and breathe out. Then slowly roll up the spine. Let your arms come back up to the ceiling. Reach up nice and tall. That's it. And exhale, fold over again. Go right back over. Down you go. Down, down, down. Everything relax. Now bend. Soft in the front knee and take your warrior one. So take that leg all the way back. And then rise up into your warrior one shape and breathe. Inhale and exhale. Inhale, exhale. On the exhale, take your hands all the way down and wiggle back into your plank pose right here. Strong, strong, strong. Push the floor away. And then drop your knees. Press yourself down to the floor. All the way down, pressing like you're pressing the floor away. Elbows in, shoulders away from the ears. Press into the pelvis and lift your heart. Inhale and exhale. On the exhale, lower the upper body. Keep it down. Both legs are going to lift up. Lengthen the legs. Lengthen as best you can. Breathe. And on the exhale, lower everything down. Push back to your child's pose. Lengthen through the hips. And then downward facing dog, lifting up and pressing. Inhaling and exhale. Elevate your heels, bend the knees, look forward and walk up toward the front of your space, folding yourself over. On the inhale, come all the way up, lifting your arms to the ceiling, stretch you up, lean back, maybe. Exhale, bring your hands to the center of your Breathe in. And breathe out. Let your hands come down by your side. All right. Your right leg, but step forward a little bit more than it did before. So look down and separate your feet a little bit as if you have six or eight inches or so between your railroad tracks. And your feet are going to be about face directly forward. Perfect. All right. Inhale. Circle the arms. Maybe lean back a little bit. On the exhale, fold forward. Let yourself go down, down, and down. Tuck your chin toward your chest. Let your head be heavy. Inhale. And exhale. Now, you can look directly at the floor so you don't knock yourself in the head here. 
bend your front knee a little bit and bring your back knee in towards your front knee and squeeze in like your little bird on a perch. So squeeze in, then drop your head again. Inhale and exhale. And then stretch that left leg out and look at the floor. Breathe in, keep your hands on the floor for now. And then cuck your, tuck your back knee in again, curl your nose toward these knees that are squeezing in toward each other. And then on the exhale, lift the leg and again, look down at the floor. And if you feel so inclined, you can start to take your arms up off the floor in any way that works for you, maybe a little airplane arm, balancing and breathing. And then slowly step back into warrior one. All the way up, go to the arms, take your time. Make sure you have that nice spacing between your legs. Additional warrior one. Inhale and exhale. Now we're going to do a little reverse twist. So bring your left arm forward parallel to the floor. Take your right arm back and try to look back and see your fingers. Inhale, exhale. And then swivel around to warrior two. Let your chest drop down, shoulders drop down. Looking, reposition your feet if you need to. Take your peaceful warrior, reaching up and back behind you, find your leg. Inhale, exhale back to warrior two, and then swivel around, going back to your funky little twisty here. Breathe in and breathe out. And back to warrior two, swiveling around. Peaceful warrior right here. Straighten out your front leg and we're gonna go right into triangle. So reach out with the arm, lean and take your shape. Opposite arm goes up as it bothers your shoulder. Just rest your top in on your hip and breathe. In and breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Now use your belly here for strength. And tap your hands behind your ears, opening up like big butterfly wings. Then turn your chest toward that front leg and then fold over with your hands staying exactly where they are. And breathe, squeezing your back muscles as you open up in all these different directions. And take yourself down, your hands are gonna come down around your front foot and breathe right here, just fold over. And then we're going to bend the front knee and come back up to warrior one. Reach all the way up to the ceiling, stretching up, lengthening. Open to warrior two and turn all ten toes to face the wall. Then your uh, all ten toes to face the same wall to your to your left. So all ten toes facing the left. Everybody, Sally, Sally. I'm sorry, I don't <laughs> Turn your toes to face the wall. Everybody up. That's it. All right. Then fold over. Okay. <laughs> Going down, down, down. Let your head go. And breathe. In. Breathing out. And then slowly bend your knees and roll up the spine all the way. And bring your feet together. You're still facing the side wall. Take your arms to the ceiling, lifting up. And then we're just going to sway in the wind. So either direction, go side to side. Take your time. Notice how it feels. One direction and the other. Finding your breath as you move. In and out. Go with that breath. Next time you pass the center, stay there. Reach up to the ceiling. On the exhale, let your hands float down by your side all the way. And then turn back to face the front. Back to the front. And stand up nice and tall. All right, take your left foot and take a bigger step than you did, you know, earlier, earlier. Make sure to look at your feet. You have a few little inches between your railroad and feet. Take your arms up to the ceiling, stretch up, maybe lean back a little bit, stretch your throat. And on the exhale, fold over this front leg, keeping it as straight as you can manage. Maybe that's not so straight, but just let yourself. Empty here. Breathe in and breathe out. Big breath in. Big breath out. Make sure that your hands are touching something, whether 
with your blocks or your or your floor. You can bend the front knee a little bit and then bring the back knee in, like a little bird on a perch, squeezing that knee into the other knee. Let your head hang down. Breathe in and breathe out. Now lengthen out the leg and look at the floor, pushing back and go on the floor. On the exhale, curl in again, knee to nose, both knees to nose, nose to knee, squeezing in. Exhaling, lengthening out. Lengthen both legs as you can, stay there. And if you want to, you can take your hands off the floor and be nice and balanced here. Breathe in and breathe out. Then land gently in your warrior one. So take that big step back, sweep the arms to the ceiling, stretching up. Nice. Inhale, exhale. And take your right arm straight forward. Take your left arm back and look back behind you. Nice funky little foot here. Inhale, exhale. Swivel around to warrior two. Adjust your feet if you need to. Bending into it, looking over your front middle finger. And inhale. We're going to swivel around. Go back to your little twisty here. Feel the rotation. Feel yourself move in space. Inhale. Exhale, come back around all the way. Warrior two. Take your peaceful warrior. Reach up and back. Lengthen. Breathe. That's it. Then straighten out your front leg and go right into your triangle. Reaching out and lowering down. Glancing up towards your top thumb. Turn your chin into your chest more than being away from it. Then connect with your tailbone. Lengthen it sort of tucking under you and then down towards your back heel and breathe in breathing out breathe in breathe out now take your hands gently behind your ears hold it there feel the nice grabbing almost of your belly and then rotate your upper body to face your front leg and then keeping the arms, lower yourself over that leg the best you can, squeezing your back muscles. Inhale. Exhale. The tendency is to roll onto that pinky side of that front foot. See if you can come more inward to the inner part of your big toe side, your arch. Inhale. Exhale. And then from here, bend your front knee. We're going to rise up to warrior one again right away. Lift yourself up, up, up. Hold it there. Again, that funky twist. So extend your right arm forward, left arm back. And then go around to your warrior two. Straighten out your front leg. Turn all 10 toes to face the side wall here. Take your arms up to the ceiling. And exhale, fold right down the center line. You can widen your stance as much as you'd like to. Let your head drop down. See where you can go with this and just breathe in and breathe out. Inhale, exhale. Slowly come on out of this. Come all the way up. Let your arms rise up to the ceiling, stretching up. And then again, we're going to roll over into the wind. And just come in, gently close over. Back and forth. Take your time. Go at your own stretchiness here. Use your abdominals. Use those obliques to pick you back up from the wind, blowing you over in one direction. Feel that. Breathe in and out. And then when you pass to the center, pause right there. Lift your arms. On the exhale, bring your hands all the way down and walk your feet in toward each other, standing up nice and tall, and then come back to face the front. And breathe. And inhale, circle your arms to rise up. And on the exhale, just hinge and fold yourself down. You go, letting yourself stretch in this very nice, just fold it over, shake. Inhale, and exhale. Inhale, lengthen and glance up. And exhale, folding in. Take your left leg all the way back to your nice long lunge. Take a big breath in here. Exhale, 
inhale, downward facing dog, lifting your hips, pressing push. Inhale, come forward to your plank. Exhale, your own way, lower yourself down. You can bring your knees down first, point your toes. Inhale, lift up to baby cobra. On the exhale, lower down, stay there, lift both legs up, holding it there. Breathe. On the exhale, lower down, pick up your upper body again, baby cobra. Press to the top of your feet, sweep your hands back behind you, interlace your fingers, and then lift your chest perhaps a little more. But keep your toes glued down to the floor. Breathe in and breathe out. Then lift both legs up a little bit again. On the exhale, release everything down. Push back to your child's pose. Stretch out. Good to see you. Be well. And downward facing dog when you're ready. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Take your left leg to the ceiling. Stretch it up. Bend your knee up there. Open the hip. Pressing towards the side wall back there. And then bring your knee all the way around. Step it forward between your hands. One big movement. Use your hand on your ankle if you need to. Come onto the fingertips. Draw your heart forward. On the exhale, bring the back foot to the front foot and fold over. Inhale, rising up. Arms filling. Take a big breath, beating back. Exhale, bring your hands to your heart. On the inhale, circle your arms. You can take them up to the ceiling. On the exhale, hinge and fold yourself down. You go. Inhale, lifting and looking up. Exhale, folding in. Right leg steps back into your nice long lunge and open up your heart. Breathe in. Breathe out. Oh, and we go. Downward facing dog. <laughs> and breathe. Inhale. And exhale. Rolling out into your plank pose, coming down in your own way. Empty the breath completely before doing anything else. Point the toes. Inhale, rolling to your cobra. Exhale, coming down. Inhale again, lifting up. Take your hands behind your back, interlace. Open up across your chest. Squeeze your upper back. Put both legs off the floor. Take a breath. On the exhale, coming down, release your hands. Push back to your child's pose. Pull your toes on the way back there. Downward facing dog, lifting your hips, pressing through. Inhale, take your right leg to the ceiling, bend the knee, open the hip towards the side wall. Hold it there for a moment, breathe. And then bring your knee around, bring your foot to your hands for your lunge. To your fingertips when you're ready, draw your heart forward. Exhale, bring the back foot to the front foot and fold all the way in. Stay right here. Breathe in and breathe out. And then stay low like this. Take your hands either on your blocks or your fingertips on the floor, your hands flat. Bend your left knee and squeeze into that little bird on a perch, inner thigh squeezing together. And then lengthen your arms and look at the floor. And then steadily as you can, come all the way up. Try to keep your foot off the floor. You're on one leg. That's it. And then when you come up, just put your foot down. All right. Inhale, circle the arms up. Exhale, hinge and fold your way down. You go. Inhale, glance and look up. And then exhale, fold and stay folded in. All right. Then the right knee, squeeze it in. Bird on a perch kind of feet. And then start to roll all the way up. All the way up. And then put your foot down once you come up. All right. Inhale, circling around again. Exhale, hinge and fold yourself down. You go. Squeezing, bending the left knee. Squeeze it in once again. And come all the way up once again. Pulling the belly in. Once you come up, keep your knee there if you can manage it. Breathe in, breathe out. Your hands to your heart, and then come into your tree pose. Bring your foot inside somewhere. If you need to keep your foot down, touching the floor, that's fine too. Put length into the spine, soften through the upper body. Breathe in, breathe 
out. And then bring that same foot behind your left, your right heel and bow into it, a little curtsy bow. Press the air away from you as you look at the floor. Inhale, exhale. And bring your hands down, bring your feet into a nice forward fold position and just let yourself go here for a moment. And then your right knee is going to squeeze into the left knee, squeeze the inner thighs together, pull the belly button, it really helps, and then start to come all the way up, all the way. Breathe in, breathe out, hands to heart. Take your tree shape. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. That foot sort of behind and over toward the left, and then bow into it, pushing the air away, curtsy bow, looking at the floor. Inhale, exhale. Inhale. Inhale, come all the way up. Separate, bring your feet toward each other. Lift your arms to the ceiling, stretch up, lean back. And then open your arms out to the side, palms facing down. Swivel around to look at your left wall and then look back behind you. And then come all the way back around the center and float the opposite direction, looking back. And then come all the way to the center. Take a big breath in here. And on the exhale, let your hands float all the way down. Separate your feet for your squat. So you can know where your squat is. And then sit down in your space. Bring your hands wherever you want your hands to be. You don't push your knees out. Be in your little, like, kind of little meditative moment. You can bring your thumbs maybe to the area between your eyebrows. Whatever feels right for you, just breathe and use this moment to center yourself. Inhale and exhale. And then slowly you're going to sit down. So use your hands as brakes. Come all the way down and bring your legs, legs out. Get up nice and tall. And then bend your left or uh, right knee. Bend your right knee, but make sure you have a hand distance between your inner thigh and your foot. All right, and then take your um, right elbow inside and kind of lean forward. So you're leaning forward, take your elbow down toward the floor as much as you can. Then sweep that right arm around the front of your shin bone. Bend your elbow and just see where your hand goes. It might go just square on the floor. That's it. Now take your other hand around to the floor. Use your fingertips for sort of gripping and then just press your chest toward your thigh. And breathe. Inhale and exhale. Now, if you want to take your left arm and hold hands with your right hand, see if you can reach around there. Maybe you can, maybe you can't, doesn't matter. Your hand can also be still out to the side. Wherever you are, just leaning into it, breathing in, breathing out, breathe in, breathe out. And then release your hands from back there and just sit up. All right, now you're going to take your, your right hand and you're going to slip it underneath your right knee. Just start to pick up your knee, you can use your hands in any way you need to, and sort of lift your knee up onto your shoulder a bit. You might not go anywhere near there, but just that's the direction. And pause right there and breathe. Then take both hands down. I'm going to lose my finger, but. The other hand goes out, that's it, and sit up nice and tall, broaden across your collarbone, maybe straighten out your legs, and breathe. Breathe in, breathing out, and then bring it down all the way, stretch it out. All right, opposite knee is going to bend. Again, measure, put your hand distance in there, give yourself that space. All right, you're going to reach forward, forward, forward with this left hand, sweep it around in front, take the other hand out, and maybe bend this, I think we did this before early on, bend the left elbow and bring your hand around, rest on your rear end somewhere, and it's going to pull you forward, your upper body, your energy is going to go forward towards your long leg, and then if you want to give it a whirl, go ahead and hold hands with yourself back there or some way, 
position yourself so that you can lean forward maybe a little more maybe drop your head if that might feel good for you inhale exhale inhale exhale and then release your hands and sit all the way up and take that left arm slide it underneath and in your own way start to pick up your your foot and your knee and just kind of get it up onto your shoulder as best you can and breathe that's it holding it there and then take your uh, hands on the floor there sit up nice and tall maybe both hands go on the floor and stretch your leg out now, if you want to hold your leg that's perfectly fine but it's flipping on nice fleece that the jcc gave me i can't hold it up on my that's it. And then release it. Bring it all the way down. Stretch your legs out evenly. Flex your feet. And just roll down those long legs. Just roll down there. Let your head go. And breathe. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale. Exhale. And slowly roll yourself up. Pick your belly button. In, roll up, roll up, roll up, and lay down all the way on your back. Down, 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 and down. And then just rest for a moment. Just rest, let your hands go beside you, palms down. Take a breath into that belly, and then expel it from the belly. See where it goes, where it's traveling to. And then bend your left knee and bring it in towards your chest. Give your hands a little. Ooh, interlace around that knee and hold it there. Then use just your left hand to move the knee out to the left. Take your right arm by your ear and then stretch the right side of your body. Press your heel away from your fingers and vice versa while you continue to move that left knee out to the side. Now take a big breath in. Fill your belly with air and hold it in. Then open your mouth, and as you exhale, bring your knee back to the center, wrap your hand around that knee, and switch legs. Bring the other knee in, stretching out the left leg, holding it down. Using your right hand, move the knee out toward the side. Take your left arm by your ear and stretch the left side of your body. Lengthen it, breathe. Hold it there and keep moving the right knee to the right. Hold it, hold it, and breathe. Now breathe in as much air as you can take in. And on the exhale, bring it around. Bring your health self-centered. And then lengthen both legs all the way on the floor. Bring your palms to face downward. Press into your palms and lift your chin and look at your feet. And then pick one foot, foot of your choice, up off the floor, glancing toward your foot, and then lower that and switch. Lower that and switch. Lower that and switch. Lower that and switch. Last time, lower switch. Lower both heels and lower your head all the way down. Look to the left, put your chin, rotate to the left. And center and let your chin rotate to the right. And look center. Turn your palms to face up. Close your eyes. And relax to the left for Nice. Right. For a few moments. 